So the, the project that we're working on together uh, with the Arts Marketing Association and the WOW Foundation, um, could you talk a little bit about, you know, the, the journey, how, how it came about and, um, you know, why, I, I guess it's not a project that Super Cool does a lot or, you know, why, why was it of, of particular interest um, to you to sort of to, to get involved and, and, and start the ball rolling with that? Yeah, so... It came about because it was interesting, I think within the space of a few weeks, um, Danny at the AMA and you and Charlie at Wow Foundation had all got in touch to say, could you do some consultancy with us to help us measure, benchmark and create action points for digital sustainability? Um, and my response to all of you separately was, mm, that's not really although we're really passionate and interested in digital sustainability we're aware that it's a really broad big subject and we sort of thought you know we can help with the website side of things but we're not the specialist when it comes to all of your other activity and you know how you're doing video conferencing and all those sorts of things because it's a really digital sustainability whilst we're talking specifically about websites at the moment it's really anything that requires digital technology uh, and that's huge, you know. Um, yeah. There's so much of what people are using now. It's just, yeah. you know, if you start work, you're immediately online. Everything you're doing is suddenly there. Yeah. And, you know, like measuring the output of all our laptops, our devices. Um, I'm in a home office. My energy consumption is going to be different to somebody else's based on, you know, how we're heating the office, what devices I have. So, I was sort of aware that we probably weren't the right people to help with the broader project. But given that all three of you had asked, I thought, actually, maybe we can sort of help with the um, website side of things. So I then went back to all three of you and said, well, actually, these people over here have asked a very similar question. And although we're not experts and it's not something that we've done in this kind of way before and um, if you're up for a bit of experimentation and collaborating and learning as we go why don't the four of us come together um, and work on it together and, and I'll share as much as I possibly can but it'll be really important that you share your learnings with each other as well um, and it because obviously we work in a lovely sector everyone thought yeah that's a great idea let's do it um, so and it was really nice because we had our first initial meeting where we chatted through what the goals were for this project, what you, um, AMA and Wild Foundation were hoping to achieve. And you all had really similar goals. It was about learning a bit more, understanding what, what has an impact, um, being able to benchmark where you're at and a set of actions for improving digital sustainability going forwards. Um, and because you're all on the same page, that means that we have been able to kind of go on this journey through this project together um, and learn as we go. Um, and I think it's been really nice. I think uh, my hope is that I think already out of this, we're starting to see the what is having a huge impact on day to day working. So it's the idea of just learning that is more important, really, than the documentation to go with it. But we're also starting to create and pull together guidelines for how to manage content, um, internal um, guidelines that people can share with other colleagues. And I think it's nice that it's helping to share the load as well. So I know you've written a bit recently about handling video content. And I think Carol at AMA is going to look at how to handle images. And I think that's a really nice way to share the load because it is a project you have to take on whilst everything else is going on. Um, but I'm hoping that sort of by spring, we'll have a really nice set of resources that as a group we've kind of, we've sort of developed that might not be things you can instantly transfer to other organizations, but sort of the process of coming up with those resources and some ideas on what they should include are things that we can definitely share with the wider sector, I think. Yeah, I think it's been great. And like you say, being able to share the load a bit and 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 have some sounding boards of, of different types of organizations as well. You know, we're we're with three quite different organizations in in the way we work uh, and and the way we store information or the types of content that we have on our websites. It, you know, it's it's really variable. Um, but I think being able to discuss those as a group and and sharing each of our own challenges and, and helping each other find ways around it. Um, I think it's been it's been a really good experience. And and yeah, not having to 
sort of feel like you're sat by yourself trying to figure it all out um and yeah because I, I don't think there's I think there's definitely a um a sort of a, a, a big level of attention uh, on on the issue that's coming through in the sector and people are starting to think about it more but I think everyone's at quite an early stage of doing it so being able to work with other organizations that are at the start of the journey as well and figure it out together and, and share and open you know be open about what we're learning I think it's it's sort of it's really exciting the sort the positive impact that we could have you know on other people in the sector as well and we can hopefully share helpful things uh, at the end of the project and and help sort of kick start other people's journeys uh, as well yeah and I think that's one of the most important things I think talking about what you're doing what's working what's not working what you found difficult is so reassuring for everyone else and really helps people it really helps put everyone at ease and think actually there's a lot I can be doing and I can start small and it's okay if I'm a bit unsure and um, we did some we did some uh, sort of analysis of lots of websites for AMA members earlier in the year. And one of the questions we asked people who requested an analysis of their website was, where are you on this journey of digital sustainability? And basically everybody said either very just starting or didn't even know it was a thing. <laughs> so, <laughs> I don't think, you know, if anyone's listening to this thinking, I had no idea this was something I needed to worry about nobody has an idea this is something <laughs> they need to worry about you're okay 